Bag lady, you go hurt your back. You can't hurry up, cause you got too much stuff. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? I need to show this stuff to these ladies, seriously. Girl, get on it. Oh my gosh, hey baby dolls, it's your girl Mo Diva. Getting some stuff ready for y'all. Um, I want to say happy holidays to you guys, to you ladies. Thank you so much for joining me. I have an amazing haul for y'all. So much so that I think I'm going to have to go ahead and break this up into three parts. So I hope that you all are doing fantastic, staying safe, uh, sanitizing and doing all the things that you need to do to stay away from, you know what, the C C19. Yeah so so willing and ready for this thing to go away right but nonetheless i i definitely need to go ahead and do a haul video so y'all can see some of the things that i've purchased um and a lot of these things are christmas related items and so i have to get it out to y'all so then i can go ahead and distribute the things where they need to go you know what i'm saying to you girl so um where can we start um let's just start with some fun food you know i'm a fluffy girl so let's What's a little bit of more candy for you? Okay, so when I saw these rocks, these reminded me of when I was a little girl. These are the Caramel Royales by Brock. And it's a pretty substantial bag. You know how sometimes in the Dollar Tree they just give you a little sample bag. You know, this is a pretty big bag of caramels. And when I'm telling you, these things are so good. This is the kind of stuff, and I'm going to open it for you. This is the kind of stuff that, uh, and I want to open it nicely. Um, this is the stuff that memories are made from. And um, they're so festive. So a lot of you are all younger. And so you're probably not familiar with these candies. But these candies came out probably in the 60s or 70s, and they are beautiful caramels. When you see Brock's, the Royale's, look, think of me. Think of Mo Diva. They're all different types of caramels, okay? So, like, this one is the Orange Royale, and it's got, like, a little hint of orange flavoring in there. This one is, like, the vanilla flavoring. Look how cute they are, and they're so good. This one, I don't know, but they're really, really good. I'm going to actually sample my favorite one. And then they have the pink one that's got, like, a little strawberry cream caramel. And then they've got the chocolate, the caramel on chocolate on chocolate. It's the brown one. Aren't these so festive? So colorful, right? Like I said, they remind me of my childhood. This is when I first got introduced. I think one of my aunties used to have these in one of her little bowls. But let's go ahead and sample one of these caramels. It's just so pretty. Look at that. See that? A little chocolate nougat inside of there. Mm. it's a rich it's kind of like a tootsie roll with caramel wrapped around it so good have some mm -hmm. it's a good time so I'll throw these in a the little candy dish and share them. So I got three bags of these. A couple weeks ago, I haven't seen them since. But hopefully your store still has these. And then I got some coffee candy. Brazilian coffee candy. 25 cents. At my favorite little store, Roses. This is going to be great to put in little packages for my friends and family, mail lady, um, the garbage people, 
put little things together for them, little bags of candy and gift cards or what have you. This stuff is great. They will love it. Okay. Um, they had the Nature's Garden Tropical Fruit Trail Mix. And this says, journey to the tropics with our delicious fruit trail mix. We've combined dried pineapple, papaya, banana chips, raisins, and dried coconut to give you the taste of paradise. So I thought that this would be great. And I have tried one, one little bag, because you get four individual packages in here. And it is nice, it's fresh, it's great, it's great. It's great, it's great. I saw some of my favorite chips there. These guacamole chips are a good time, girl. For sure. So I got two of those. And it's basically, it's it's like a, it's a flavored tortilla chip, like guacamole. To be quite honest, I really can't taste the guacamole. It's just something kind of interesting, interesting flavor. But they're a good quality chip. So I went ahead and purchased two of those. Okay. Um... Actually, well, well, it's in another bag. I was going to continue on with like the food items, but um, they have these teaser brushes. And I thought that this will be good to not only tease my hair, which I don't really do a lot of teasing, but I thought it would be great to kind of work with my edges. This will lay those edges down great. And then especially with this little tip here, you can use that tip to define the fine the edges a little more so they had this in purple this teal color and pink but I wanted the teal all right um when I saw this I was like oh my gosh this is so cute this says Mary Mary and bright it's a cute little tumbler and I got two of them and so this is what they look like can you see that where it says Mary and bright and it's got that beautiful kind of era destiny color. Got two of these. I love them. I only saw three on the shelf. And I did notice that these little things here kind of were messing up a little bit. But it clicked right back on. And so it just is clear there. And so you can't see it, but that's a little spout. So diva fabulous. I love them. If I can find some more of these, these are great. And it's just a sheet of paper inside of there. You cannot tell. But these are fabulous, girl. You can have your iced coffee. You can have your water. You can have whatever it is, some eggnog in here, girl, and just go for it. Merry and bright. They both say merry and bright. If I can find more, this was a great find. I just found these today, and today is December 3rd. So they just put these out, I think. Um, what else did I find? I found this cute little squishy toy, and she was just so cute. It's for three-year-olds, but of course, I'm going to put her in the little china cabinet back there. And it's just a cute little llama or whatever, and it's a, it's a fast-rising squishy. But I just love her. Isn't she cute? Look at all the beautiful colors. And this is what she looks like on the back side. They just really, it's like, man, am I three? Why do I like this? I'm 51, but I love all this stuff right here. It's so cute. She is so cute. Mwah. All right. Okay, so I'm going in on <laughs> these cute little trolls. They are so cute. These are men's fashion socks. I had to go ahead and get them. And it's just got all these beautiful little colors here the red the whites the blues the brown which is a very interesting contrast of colors and so i do collect socks so i thought that this would be great for my collection love them a dirty mask y'all wash your mask every single day okay that's what i do i wash all of my masks i keep about four or five of them in my purse and i just wash them every day I was so excited to find some more phone cases. Okay, and so this is for the iPhone 7 Plus and 8 Plus. And it's just this galaxy kind of textured glitter. 
it's textured so I had to get two two dollars for some fabulous phone cases let's bring that up closer for you isn't that cute I love them Dollar Tree is like y'all know I've been hauling well maybe a lot of you don't know I've been hauling going to the Dollar Tree for probably over I don't know 15 20 years now and as the years progress they just never cease to amaze me they continue to do better and better and better and better and i'm here for it all the time all right so then they have some videos and they always come out with videos uh right before christmas and um i got double on some of them because i plan on giving some away but i got the katie holmes miss meadows justice is sweet all right, a Pulp Fiction Mary Poppins type of movie. But I thought that it was so ironic that she has a gun. So, okay, so she is like a fierce Mary Poppins. All right, so I can't wait to watch that. Then this one is called King uh, of Paper Chasing, King of Paper Chasing. And this has, who knows, I can't tell who was in here. But I just kind of love the cover, and I thought it would be a good little Saturday, Saturday afternoon or whenever uh, to watch a movie. And then this Leela and Eve, Viola Davis and Jennifer Lopez. Never heard of this movie. It must have went straight to video. But they look like some bad chicks here. Looks like they're definitely rough and tough. Uh, J-Lo with the little fur. <laughs> and so that's going to be good. So I went ahead and got two copies of this one because I just thought that that looked fierce. Woman power. Okay, and then this one is with uh, Michelle Williams. Christopher Plummer and Mark Wahlberg, who I love. This was called All the Money in the World. It looks like kind of like maybe an action movie. So some good actors in here and actresses. And then this one is with Alec Baldwin and Selma Hayek. I love both of them. Called Drunk Parents. Okay, this looked kind of interesting. So I went ahead and purchased that one. And I got some more movies, but I have no idea where they're at. So we will come back and show that to you at a later time, y'all. And then the little girly in me saw these coloring books and I just went crazy. This one is called Colored Llamas. And yes, I did get this one for me. And this is by Vision Street. There at the bottom. And let me just show you some of the pages. All right, some fun little stuff to do. Looks like a llama and a Christmas tree. Christmas themed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. So cute. All right, and then this next one, I loved it. It was called The Tropical Party. And the wor a world of fantastic flamingos and fun for little ones. In the pages of this amazing book, children will find lovely characters to fill with color. But in my case, I am going to be filling these little things out with color. All right, and so let's go ahead and go through some of the pages here. The little unicorn and flamingo and that cute little plant and alligator oh boy we're gonna have all kind of fun and you know what I like to do sometimes when I do these coloring things I will go ahead and cut the pages out and then I will laminate it and just like keep it just for whatever so it's like the coloring part is fun and then the laminating part is really fun too actually where is my laminator I haven't seen a laminator in a while i think it's over here somewhere who knows we'll we'll find the laminator and i'll show you what i'm talking about one day all right so there are those aren't those cute things so i got some more glue for my nails and this is the kiss glue this is what i glue on my nails with so i got two of those i got some coconut this is the fiesta tropical coconut flakes and being that we are in the holiday season i will be doing a lot of baking so that's uh, the um, 
coconut in the back there but it looks so nice and fresh and as I'm squeezing it it's very soft so I'm hoping that that's gonna be great for baking and then I got a new Keurig machine early early Christmas gift I've gotten a lot of early Christmas gifts and so what I wanted to do is go ahead and get some k-cups and instead of spending a lot of money I thought I would just use utilize the k-cups that the Dollar Tree has and kind of go for it so here's another one of the glues and so the ones that I wanted to try I've never tried these and this is the the donut shop blend and you get four K cups 25 cents for a cup of coffee so I got that one and I love the packaging the donut and I just redid my little coffee station it looks so cute let's check and see what's going on Dollar Tree phone case yes yes I do utilize this stuff one of my girlfriends is asking me a question okay I will get back to you all all right and so anyway back to the K cups I'm so sorry I was rude right um donut shop blend look at those sprinkles and this is by grind worthy so I got one two three of the grind worthies okay the OCD in me has to show you this stuff correctly and it says that these are good until 8 01 21 so I will definitely drink these by then so I got three of those then I got three of the donut cafe classic blend this is by copper moon and this is what that looks like again 4k cups has anyone tried these what do y'all think about these are they good did I waste my dollar what's up girl tell me how about you girl let me know so I got three of those we'll do the Vanna Whites okay because I think that's why we all like doing these videos sometimes at least All right, and then also we got some French vanilla. Yes, we did, four of them, and this is by Grind Worthy as well, okay? So you know what? We're almost finished here, and then this is Copper Moon French Roast. Let's go ahead and open up one. Hmm, which one should we open up so we can see the packaging? Which one do y'all want me to open up? Okay, let's do a game, shall we? Let's do a game of which one will she open up? So, being that my one of my nicknames is Mo, we're going to do Eeny, Meeny, Miny, Mo. Okay, Eeny, Meeny, Miny, Mo. Catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him pay $50 each day. My mother told me to pick the best one, and you are it. <laughs> so we're going to open up the pink one from the, do the donut shop. And I just love it. Love, love, love the package. Girl, my mother was right, honey. She is always right. Girl, they are individually packaged. They are individually packaged for freshness. Mm, it smells divine. Let's go ahead and open up one. Doing this just for you. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so just a basic little thingy. You couldn't really ask for much more, but... Here it is. Here's the K-cup. Okay. There's the coffee. Thank you, Mom, for choosing the best one for me, girl. So we'll just wrap these back up. So anyway, if y'all have tried these, let me know. And what do you think about it? All right. So there is that. I hope you don't mind if I put these back in here. Because this will... And I got 10 of them. So one, two, three, four... 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then one fell on the floor. Ten. Okay, so we can take all this stuff downstairs now and put it away. All right, so there is that. And we are 20 minutes in the video. Do y'all want me to continue or do you want to come back for part two? Tell me what. Really? Continue a little bit more? Okay, how about five more minutes? We'll try for five, maybe seven more minutes. We'll see. I don't want to hold y'all too long. All right, and so then I found some amazing goodies. They're glass. Okay, y'all know, I know how to find the fabulous stuff, okay? When I go to the Dollar Tree, I look for the off the beaten path, hidden secret, treasure hunt, worth more than a dollar stuff. You know what I mean? Yes, girl, that's what you need to do. So when I found these, I was like, I was like, girl, get out of here. You mean to tell me you are selling retinol for a dollar? Girl, they have retinol for one dollar. I looked on eBay. They're selling these for about ten dollars each, girl. This is retinol, pure retinol. Let's put on our dollar dollar tree little readers. These are fabulous too, aren't they, girl? Yes, I got them from the Dollar Tree, girl. All right, so the this is from Skin Nutrition's Double Strength Retinol Night Repair Serum. Flawless, younger, perfect. Okay, it's a great formulation. It says. Anyway, for all skin types, I'm gonna try this. And I, I thought, you know what? What if it really works? What if it really gets rid of fine wrinkles? Okay, I've got a few fine wrinkles. What if it does? And then I've only got one. Okay, so I said, you know what, girl? Invest in yourself a little bit. Go ahead and get seven. I mean, that's $70 right there. So girl, I went ahead and got seven of the retinols. Okay, off the beaten path. They were hidden. Somebody hid them. And so I said, you know what, if you're hiding them, they must be worth something. So let me go ahead and research and see how much they're worth. $10. So I got seven. Seven. I can't hold them all up in the glass. I don't want to break them. I'll let you know what I think about it, girl. But yeah. Yeah. I know. Awesome. All right. And then I found a cute little dish. For my for my desk at work and i just love the color color combination now it looked like it was chipped somewhere on the side but i said you know what i can hide that little chip it's not a chip it's just a discoloration and so i thought this was so cute isn't that so cute it would even look so cute here in the boutique look at that little sprinkles so dainty and so cute and it's a substantial size too girl i love it 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 definitely would go in the china cabinet for sure all right and so those were those little boutique little pieces this is definitely a boutique piece this is definitely a boutique piece and this is definitely a boutique piece for uh, the boutique all right so, what else can I show you? Oh my God, I'm so happy that I'm going through this stuff, y'all, because seriously, I'm mailing a lot of this stuff out. I found some scrumptious cookies. Don't those just look so divine with the chocolate and the marshmallow creamy and the white icing? It just looks so good. And so, yeah, I'm going to be taking these to work probably, or I might actually mail my grandmother one because she loves this kind of stuff. So I got two of those and it looks like you get, it says made with vanilla filling added whole cream. And I think you get like four cookies or so, either four or six big cookies. Mm, that sounds so good. And then they have these LED projector lights, and they are so cute. I got two of them, and they really, really do work. I was looking to see if it's in here. But it just basically projects the galaxy on your ceiling or on your wall, and it is so cute at nighttime. It's like kind of like just like a fantasy wonderland. It's amazing. 
and um yeah and so these are really really cool actually it doesn't even yeah it does take a trip a double a battery or triple a battery the ones that are really small back here just two of them i think all right and then i've been doing a lot of knitting lately i've done some fabulous things for christmas and so i wanted to go ahead and get some more yarn and i got these two beautiful uh yarn rolls chunky and this is the taupe color i love 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 that color and then i got one white and one cream can't beat it and then did i show this to y'all already i don't think i think i showed you some of these little toothbrushes this one's called toothy toby <laughs> he is so cute and what i do is i put them in my purse with a little thing of toothpaste. So I'm able to brush my teeth whenever I go into the office twice a week. So I got this one. And then I showed you the other ones that I got. Um, this one is called, this one's called Ricky. So cute. And then this one is called Milky, Milky Wayne. So cute. But of course, they're for kids, and so yeah, it says you can collect all of them, so they have different ones. Got those. And then I got some more of these pens. These pens are everything. I'm actually using one right now. This is by Crayola. These are the gel pens. They are nice. It flows so nicely. And so I went ahead and got some more colors, and these are the colors that I got. Yeah. All right. Pretty, pretty, pretty colors. Love them so much. I got some peanuts for my husband. He loves these. And so I went ahead and got two of them. And this is the big one. This is the big packaging. All right, what else? Oh, and I haven't seen these anymore either. But these are the Smart Care Fisher Price Baby Wipes 99% Water right but what i got it for is i got them because i put my cleaning fluid in here and then i use them just like wet wipes or just like um you know the lysol wipes i make my own and so i ended up getting about 10 of these so really really good i think you get 64 wipes in here so once you pour your alcohol or once you pour your bleach or once you pour your cleaning fluid just keep it in here squish it around Keep it all over the house. Keep them all over the house so you can constantly be wiping door handles and light switches and your hands and just wherever, girl. Just continue to just continue to clean. And so this will help with that when you get something like this. Um, I got some more of the Take Note washable pens. And again, this is by Cray Crayola and they are fabulous. But when you go to work, girl, you have to watch your pens because they will definitely just disappear. So that's why I always get two and three of things because they're constantly disappearing. I have to like hide my stuff. But these are really, really good pens if you see them. I got some Crayola erasers just for the heck of it because they're colorful. Look how colorful those are. You know, I come from the generation of Sesame Street, Electric Avenue, uh, Mr. Rogers neighborhood. It was so colorful, right? And so this kind of stuff reminds me of my childhood. And so I'm thinking that's why I always get a lot of colorful stuff because it was just good times back in the 60s and 70s for sure. So um, you get um, how many? 30 of them. And it's really, I mean, look at those colors. Don't they make you happy? All right. Um, we're going to get ready to end here because we're at 30 minutes, but we've got some biscotti Italian original recipe, uh, recipe from a solo dolce. Oh my gosh, these are originally made in Italy. They are fully, fully Italian biscottis. This is fabulous with tea, fabulous with coffee, great little snack. So I had to get two of them. Okay. And then they have a cute little seal on the back. Okay, and again, this will be great to put in a little basket too. 
absolutely why not um i got some of these bowls here because i do plan on possibly i don't know i just got them just in case girl just in case we have company but we're probably not gonna have company but i just couldn't let these go because they were just so fabulous hammerhead bowls and they're gigantic you can do all kind of stuff with this you know if you want to have a few of your girlfriends come over and y'all do some facials and you need some water um as your little um as your little sink you could pour some hot water in here uh for your manicures you could do your you know hands put them in here for a manicure if you want to do a facial and wipe off the mask have this as your sink and just go for the spa day girl and so i went ahead and just got four just in case even if it's just me and another girlfriend sitting six feet apart we could possibly do that right so four of these great idea or you can just use them to put some potato chips into all right all right um did i get two of these i got two now i'm not really into the collecting of the little red truck but i thought you know what this would probably be good for work um this is really really popular i thought we could put this on the door so i went ahead and purchased two of the merry christmas trucks and they are adorable they are just so christmasy for sure okay and this is what they look like on the back with the cute little christmas tree i mean dollar tree pretty impressive if i must say so myself i love them all right so i got two of those and also i'm thinking you know what you could just give this to somebody as a gift as well you could put together a little package and and put that in into the gift too and make it look amazing girl we're in 32 minutes we've got to end here we've got to hurry up and end this stuff okay something random we got some a1 steak sauce do plan on having some steak this week. Um, now, this is what I wanted to show y'all. These cute Tis the Season cups. This is, no, this says Tis the Season. And then this one says have a cup of cheer. I do have about 10 coworkers that I'm going to be giving the same exact thing, girl. Okay, and so I'm going to be putting packages together. And let me show you what I'm going to do. So I got these little, little plastic containers with the cute little plastic, red plastic lids, right? So y'all have seen these. They're pretty substantial. Here's my hand. Okay, so they're pretty substantial. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put like some red shred in here or maybe some gold or whatever whatever Christmas color I want to do it's going to be it's going to go in here shred it up then I'm going to lay did I bring the cup girl let me show you then because this is really what I wanted to do so I'm going to put the little shred in then we've got these cups right then I'm going to lay this cup in here it's going to be raised up because it's going to have the little shreds in here Okay, and then I'm going to add, you know, just some candies or chocolates or something like that. Um, what else? I wish I had some candies or something to show you. But let's just say we put this in here. I had some candies that I showed you in my last video. But anyway, I'm going to show you once it's all finished. But this is basically what it's going to be like. Okay, and then I'm going to put one more little thing over here. And then I'm going to put a $5 Starbucks gift card in them. And that's going to be, that's going to be the Christmas gift. Just a little something. So I think it'll end up being, so let's see, the candy, the mug, the plastic container. So that's three. And then the $5 gift card, so under $10 for each employee, that's going to be a fantastic gift, right? All right, so I got lots and lots of these little containers, but they're, they're all the Let It Snow um, motif because I like that design. 
so much. I thought that was so cute. Okay. And then we got the mugs. So just a variety of different mugs. But these girl, even though these say Mary and Bright, and this would look amazing in here too. I don't think it, yeah, it would fit, girl. Um, I might give this one to one of my favorite co-workers. Okay, I'll put this in here like this. Okay, and again, I might do like maybe some white, white paper in here. Who knows, something blingy and put that in there, girl. It. this is my favorite and so that's that and I'm going to show you the finished result once I get done okay um but for right now it's all about the haul video but I have a lot of stuff that I've got to do now that I've showed this stuff to you okay and so I got a whole bunch of those plastic container containers and then I got some of these Christmas trees these are the white ones and this is going to go for the office too and they're just the basic Christmas trees they're very very thin but that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and diva it up and put them in the office. A little something. So I got two of those. And then last but not least, I am going to be utilizing these dish drying mats this year for placemats. And I just love the print. And so I got four of them. Okay. And I will show you the end result of my tablescape this year too. So y'all, this is like a really, really long video. I'm surprised you're really, really still here. If you are, thank you so much. Give me a thumbs up. Um, happy holidays to y'all. Let's go ahead and just continue to have a fabulous year. Let's go ahead and ride 2020 out strong. I love you, but God loves you so much more. Remember that pretty is as pretty does. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. All right. Let's go ahead and end the video.